Manipur's Chura Chandpur district is witnessing a sudden spike in dengue cases. With three fresh cases reported yesterday, the total number of cases has spiked to 58, while active cases currently stand at 8. And this was informed by District Mal Malaria Officer Dr. Liang Gao Muan. While speaking to Northeast Live, the DMO further informed that of the active cases, two are currently admitted at the district hospital, while the rest are undergoing treatment at home with assistance from ASHA workers. Expressing concern over the sudden spurt in cases, Dr. Liang Go Mon attributed it to lack of awareness among the people while noting that cases are expected to rise even further. Well, in this regard, the DMO also highlighted various steps that are being undertaken under his initiative for generating awareness among the people with the help of local media, public address systems, among others. Well, also speaking on the occasion was Chief Medical Officer or CMO Dr. Kim Simthe, who along with the DMO made a fervent appeal to the people of the district to strictly follow preventive measures to curb further spread of the disease. I would like to appeal to the general population that as the dengue cases is on the rise uh, from October regarding this dengue, if any person is having a, uh, symptoms of fever, headache, joint pain, or body ache, and any bleeding disorder or body rashes, they should go immediately to any health facilities to the uh, nearest uh, site and then to get a uh, proper treatment, uh, not to uh, take any self-medication. Our department, we have uh, taken uh, uh, steps in order to reduce this uh, outbreak by uh, conducting this uh, uh, larva survey and source reduction, miking in all the uh, villages, and uh, uh, fogging wherever uh, positive cases are there. And uh, sample of the positive cases are collected and sent for confirmation. Today, we have three new cases in Churchanpur town area. And among that, the total number of uh, patients currently admitted in district hospital Churchanpur is two. And we have one discharge from district hospital church and poor and the number of active cases currently is eight and the total number of recovered cases is 50 and the total cases so far which is confirmed in church and poor district is uh, 58 and the uh, steps that we are currently taken to curb uh, or to control this dengue outbreak includes uh, fogging activities larval studies activities, source reduction activities by different staff and teams in coordination and collaboration with uh, village authority, NGOs, church leaders and others. This dengue testing is freely available in district hospital, Church Anpur, for those who want to avail this opportunity. The possibility of increasing is still there because like we cannot uh, reach each and every household in our district and we cannot teach or we cannot uh, give awareness to each and every family but however we are trying through newspaper, local media and so many other things and so many other resources to make the people aware Meanwhile, the State Health Department has issued an alert after as many as 358 cases of dengue were reported this year Well, this is the highest in the last three years uh, we have been having this case for the last uh, two, three months or so. The government has been doing everything. The government has been going to the places where it has been affected. We've been taking up uh, steps to control it. And we have managed to control it, uh, I would say. Because the number that we have now, as of now, in Manipur is 358. So uh, the number, since it's a little high, that's why uh, we thought it very, very important, other than the ones which we have been taking up at, at all the places. Uh, we think it's very important this that the awareness of this particular uh, 
for this illness, dengue, which is caused by the mosquito, the Aedes aegypti, should go to every nook and corner of our state. We have districts which is uh, relatively high. We also have districts which they, where there are no cases. So, example in Tengnopal district in the border area, we do have around 100 and we do uh, uh, till now till the uh, 3rd of November 2022, we had around 199 cases. And uh, next is uh, Chorchampur Medical College, uh, Chorchampur uh, district. We've been having 38 cases. Imphal West we have 36, and uh, Thobal 10 and uh, Kakching 3, Ukrul 2, like that, and Kamjong 0. So, uh, likewise, in Bishanpur, we have 7. Uh, so, and uh, we, we at, at present, as of uh, now, we do have only 8 patients who are admitted in the hospital, as of uh, today. And all of them are being taken care of, and all of them are stable. Uh, but uh, we make it a priority now that the importance of taking up steps to control it. Uh, it is just to create an awareness. It's not to just to cause to panic. There is no, uh, we need not panic. We just need to be aware. I wanted to emphasize that we did not panic and the government, we're taking up all steps. Everything is in order. Uh, we would like to request all the people of the of our state to be aware of how we can fight against this. We can stop this, the spread of this thing. You see, uh, I don't think there's any, uh, maybe the scientists uh, the, the thing would know, but I don't think there's any vulnerability in this. Uh, uh, it's just that, and one particular thing about this, this, this mosquito mostly bites during the daytime. They say uh, the, the dawn to the dusk. As soon as, you know, the uh, starts saying dawn to dusk, this is a time when the mosquito bites. That's why they, they, the day bites by the mosquitoes are, uh, are, are a, a, of a concern in uh, as far as the dengue cases are um, concerned. You see, early detection, we do have symptoms. Uh, like say, you, uh, you have fever, body ache, like a normal, uh, any uh, this thing can be. But the most important thing is, and, and it, it usually comes around five, six to six days after the bite. So if you have any symptoms, uh, I think you should come, go to go to the doctor and rule it out. It, and it doesn't mean it's going to be dengue. One thing I want to make it particular is that just because you have fever, body ache, because the normal flu, normal normal viral thing is also there, we need not be worried that it will be dengue. It's not that. It's just most important than that is the awareness to maintain a you know the, uh, uh, the that breathing ground for the uh, mosquito should be wiped off.